report with two guys and a pie. We're the two guys, and this is episode three of season two. Not season three, because I saw a post saying it was season three. It's not season three, it's season two. <laughs> but anyways, guy, I have no idea where we're going. So you're going to have to give me directions. Where are we going? We're going to Bruno's Pizzeria, located on Merritt Island, Florida, in the Home Depot Plaza. It is the original Bruno's in Florida, and I am looking forward to trying their pie. So Bruno's Pizzeria, we're coming for you. See you there. that part of give, give us a comment on that where's your walk back to the car yeah. we don't have that today. we just <laughs> have we just have discussion time about Bruno so guy what did you think Bruno well like I told Kyle oh, I'm not supposed to mention people's names um I'm giving it a nah I'm not giving it a one I'm just joking on that one uh I really enjoyed the pie I've, I've been a customer for Bruno's pizza for a long time and uh I, I haven't had a pizza in years I was telling you that just a little bit ago haven't had a pizza from there in the years and I wasn't I was not disappointed I really thoroughly enjoyed the pie uh, the crust was kind of chewy then as it cooled down it got a little chewier um, it wasn't bad uh, the, the sauce there's my complaint again I can just I, there wasn't enough on it I hardly could see it but what I can taste the sauce I liked it it was a tasty sauce to me um, the pepperoni was a, was really good I really like the pepperoni I when I the pepperoni I, I enjoyed it Enjoy the taste. I got a crispy pepperoni like one of my slices, and I really like that. So I think they could have been a little cooked a little bit longer and got that crispiness of the pepperoni to come out. The cheese is a 50-50 um, blend um, of Baccio, he said. Baccio. Yeah, whole milk and uh, uh, skim. Skim. Yeah. yeah. Which had a little bit of sweetness. You noticed it, and as soon as you said it, I'm like, yeah, that's what I'm tasting. It was a good cheese. I, I enjoyed the cheese. I got uh, all in all, this is a great pie. I I, have, I enjoyed it. Other guy. Yeah, let's break down the uh, the flavor palette for you, because uh, because like he said, he couldn't taste the sauce. The sauce was kind of thin, but when you uh, got the cheese away from it, the mozzarella, because um, the the sweetness kind of overpowered the the true roasted tomato flavor of that sauce, which was really fantastic when you had it as a standalone. Uh, as you said, the mozzarella had a sweet that sweet flavor. The pepperoni tasted like it was a pork base to me, so that's why it crisped up a little uh, easier than. Uh, your normal beef pepperoni because I had crispy edges on just about every one of my pepperonis and I love it. Uh, the crust that is our problem area, but the first slice was it went through and it was nice and crisp and crunchy, but it did cool down and get chewy rather fast. So that is a negative knock against this pie. But I think this is going to be one of those pies that when you reheat it, that crust is going to come back to life again uh, as long as you eat it. Eat it while it's warm because it's going to crisp up nice. Yeah, I, think, I think that's just what I think. I think that's what's going to happen too. I'll probably reheat it at 450 in a conventional oven, which I have been switched over to from the toaster oven. I seem to be getting a better result when I sort of do it in the regular oven. I had been suggested to do it on a um, frying pan by somebody who's in the pizza business for a long time. I haven't quite attempted that yet. It's in the back of my mind. One of these days, I'm going to take a shot at it, but not for this pie. I want to try it now, but it's how it works. All right, guys. So what we're here for is, of course, the the dancing pepperoni rating. 
Because we go from one to five. I don't know why you're laughing. It doesn't seem all that funny. Because um, this is serious business. This is, yes, this, it is. is this is rating a pizza. Yes, it is. This is not a laughing matter. You're absolutely. I don't correct. know why you're laughing. Stop laughing, or I'll smack you. You want me to smack you? Start laughing again. <laughs> okay, but anyways, we're here for the rating of the dancing, the dancing pepperonis, and uh, guy, what do you give Bruno's Pizzeria of Maryland, the original location, one near you, only if you live in Cocoa Beach and Merritt Island, because that's their only two locations. If you live elsewhere, then you're going to have to travel for it. But what do you give Bruno's Pizzeria in Merritt Island as a rating? I give it four dancing pepperonis. Four, four dancing pepperonis? Mm -hmm. That sounds good to me. I think it is well worthy of a four dancing pepperoni. Absolutely. And by now you've seen four dancing pepperonis four times because I just said it again. Uh, Can we go a fourth time? I just did it four times. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. I, are you keeping up with what's going on here? I, I don't know. I got smacked pretty I think hard. He's, I think, yeah, he got smacked pretty hard and he's in a pizza coma right now. <laughs> um, but that's what we have for you today on our third episode of season two, not three. Season two. Um, if you like the video, give us that thumbs up. Leave a comment. Tell us where you want us to go next. Uh, if there's a favorite pizza place that we haven't been to, let us know because we'd love to try it out. Uh, always subscribe. There's that little button like right over here that says subscribe. Click on it. And then make sure you click on the bell so you get notifications of when every video is out. And there's a notification for you. See, that's, that's, what happens if you that's what happens if you click the bell. And don't forget, uh, Guy here will leave a reheat update on the blog, which there'll be a link down below for the blog written review of Bruno's Pizzeria, the original location Merritt Island, Florida. in Merritt Island, Florida. So until next time, love and pizza slices. Can we skip that? Can we beat that? Can we delete back that up and start again? Because I don't know why I had five on my mind. It's supposed to be a four. Cut. Yeah.